Hello, folks, and welcome to For the Warp. For the Warp is a space-based tactical rogue, card-based roguelike. It's basically Slay the Spire meets Halcyon 6. Like, it's basically Halcyon 6, like spaceships, with sort of Slay the Spire-esque card-based roguelikeness. Um, yeah, we're gonna go straight in. I've done, I've played the first um, map before coming into this, but we're gonna start from scratch. I unlocked the, the second, um, the second um, ship. You start off only with a standard frigate, which has a health of 75, shields of 10. I've unlocked the light destroyer, which is the second one, and I haven't actually played with you yet, so we're gonna start with you. The nearest warp gate was destroyed, and you had no option but to take the longest route. This was a dangerous system, far away from the nearest pan-human controlled system. You carry a valuable cargo, maybe not entirely legal or ethical, but enough to make all of this worth it. Just maybe. I like the little animated guns there. <clears throat> market. You found your way into a big market station. You need to prepare for the journey ahead. Spend your money wisely. Ooh, okay. Inspiring shot. Deals five damage to target and draw one card. Uh, optimi optimize shielding. Fully charges your shields. Weapons charged. Increases increase by 50% until the end of the turn. Draw a card. An auxiliary reactor. Which increases energy per turn. I'm gonna go for that, because it's, it's always been a useful thing to have. Every single time. Whenever it's always useful. And I'm also gonna grab the repairing, inspiring shot. The extra card draw. <clears throat> so, similarities with... Um, with Slay the Spire include things like you have your cards, you have your point defense, which is charges your shields, you have basically you have attack cards, you have defense cards. Unlike Slay the Spire, shields last. They're not like defense in Slay the Spire expires at the end of the turn, whereas shields stay until they're removed. Gatling Gun draws two damage and draws a card, so it's a very quick cantrip, costs nothing to just do the damage and draw a new card. Inspiring Shot, of course, does a bit more damage than that and draws a card. Point defenses charge of shields. Uh, our equipment, of course, makes me have an extra. We have four energy per turn rather than three. Very, very good for us. Um, and you basically move on a. Instead of having that the tree that you get in Slay the Spire, you have a map you move around. And your ship can move in any of eight directions, provided they're not blocked. And then you can see what's in the squares beside you. So let's go straight into a fight and see what happens there. In your first turn, you get five cards, but in your first time, you only get three for some reason. Uh, you can see what their, their intent is. Their intent is going to attack for 3 to 9 damage. You don't get as perfect information as you do in Slay the Spire. Um, let's go for... Oh, you have no choice, really. You've got 4 energy because of that, because of that equipment. So we're going to go for point defense, point defense, which gives us 12 out of 15 shields, which are permanent. They do not go away. So once they've been reduced by this, the remainder will stay with us. We'll do 5 damage. Draw a card and gets us to do that as well. There you go. Brilliant. Four damage to us. The remainder of our shields are still there. Uh, inspiring shot. Uh, plasma burst, plasma burst. They're defending two to five next turn, so. Three to five, nine there. Inspiring shot. Uh, plasma burst. There you go. Having extra energy is actually very helpful. End of combat, you get some money, you get some fuel, and then you get card choices. Scorching Blast, ignites two, deals 10 damage. If the target is already on fire, deals 20 damage instead. Or Inspiring Resilience, charges five shields and draws a card. Uh, let's take the extra damage. Ignite does that much damage. There's two damage per turn for two turns. Ignite three would do two damage for three turns. Okay, so... There's a distress signal over there. There's a question mark event over here. So go for the question mark event. You found a friendly British ship. They made an offer. If you're interested, they'll give me sixty cards for my fix. They'll give me sixty dollars for my thirty dollar point defense card. I'll sell a point defense card for money. Let's head towards that distress signal. Uh -huh. Let's go for the distress signal. You found a destroyed orbital habitat. 
Millions lived here. Something has gone terribly wrong. And nothing. Okay. No event happening this time around. Obstacle, distress beacon, enemy, random encounter, market station. The market station over there. Oh, let's go for the let's go for the enemy first. Then we'll go for the market station afterwards. Proximity alert. Pirate vulture and a pirate disruptor. Let's deal with the one that does um, more. Le that's quicker to kill to die first, which is you. Some damage, right? Um, scorching burst again, because I'll kill you. Then point the little point of defense. Just get some shields up. Then we can go for scorching burst. There's ten damage, but minus three for the shields and minus seven overall. Three to nine attack. Don't care. Double plasma burst. Oh, yeah, plasma burst. Uh, Gatling gun. Gatling gun. So we can. They're free. Scorching burst again. Twenty damage and plasma burst three shield. There we go. A little bit of damage, but otherwise pretty good. Extra money. Twisted Firestorm. Ignite free to all enemies. Wow, it worked very, very well for us, actually. That would work very, very well for us. With that infernal thing we've got there. Uh, trade station. And there's also another distress. There's another random event over there. We need to get to the warp gate, so we're going to go straight to the trade station and see what's available. Uh, Rama Station has long empty corridors. Most of the usual traffic is now gone, but it still has some working services. We can overfield, which is a charge 9 to shields. Ammunition spares gives 3 damage for a target for free. Antimatter blast deals 6 damage to target if AM generator is in hand and deals 12 damage instead. We can also buy some fuel. <clears throat> I'll buy you, because if, if you're going to buy that, this is a better defense weapon. I want to keep my, I wanna keep my deck quite spare. Really. Keep my like my um, my numbers down. Rogue AI factory. Defense two to five shields. Well, you can fire everything at once. They've put some shields up, which immediately got destroyed by the uh, fire, which is good. Um, attacking three to nine. Gatling gun, obviously. Scorching blast will make a lot of damage to you, and we can kill you off with plasma roasts. I'm not entirely sure about the card balancing at the moment, because this is early days, I think, but I'm not sure about the card balancing. You feed the core, which discards your hand to deal 12 damage. As long as it's the last card you play, it's not a problem. Um, proximity alert. It's two free space. Oh, free space, right, a free space frigate. Uh, you'll deal five damage to target unless you draw a card. You need to draw a card. There you go. So point defense, plasma burst, and keep the core. No damage there. Okay, so immediately we go for Gatling Gun because we need to draw a card. We've got four energy now. Inspiring shot. Let's just get a little bit more card draw. Uh, attack three to nine, so an overfield will nullify that entirely. And plasma burst, point defense. There you go. Um, attack, attack. So we're being, we're being double attacked right now. So I can actually kill you. So I'm going to go for overfield, plasma burst. Feed the core kills you off. So plasma burst on you, then feed the core. We can't get through our shields. Attack, 8 to 16 damage attack. So Gatling Gun, that's free. Um, Inspiring shot. Overfield to max out our shields. We'll two energy left. Scorching blast. Did the full 18 damage on us. Oh well. Uh, Gatling gun. Uh, scorching blast. Uh, three to nine, so overfield, and then oh, three to four. Gatling gun. A twisted fire starter. Uh, we win because they've got no shields. So Scorching Blast is 20, and then Plaza just finishes them off. There we go. Uh, shield Ricochet deals 5 damage to target and charges 5 shields. Yeah, we'll take that. Um, move towards this way. Go over there. 
as we can. Keep on an unknown gate key. This may lead to the location of valuable assets. Okay. What can I do with that gate key? I'm not a clue. Not a clue. Um, go over to you. Ooh. You found a crate in the middle of nowhere. It could be something valuable, space junk, or rigged explosion. Open it? Yes, please. Got a counter maneuver. <clears throat> if an enemy is attacking, it deals 15 damage. We'll take that. Thank you very much. Uh, you found a pan human repair ship. They offer to repair 20% of your max HP. Thank you. For free, apparently. Nice. And go for the warp gate. Might as well. <clears throat> Simply alert. Free space pirate boss number two. Defense four to ten. So we go to go Gatling gun. We can do everything now. We can go. Yeah, we can go. Twisted fire starter, which sets you on fire. Shield ricochet does some damage. Charges some shields and scorching blast. Does plenty of damage to you. <clears throat> right. Twenty to twenty-four attack on me is not great. Gatling gun. Um, counter because you're attacking, uh, counter maneuver. Um, overfield, inspiring shot. Feed the cord is the most damage. So there you go. Did a lot of damage to us though. Defense four to ten shields. Gatling gun, obviously. Gatling gun again. Uh, scorching blast with a massive amount of damage it does. Uh, shield ricochet, obviously, and plasma burst. Damage in. All I can. Uh, Gatling gun. Gatling gun. Attack 6 to 12, so. Inspiring. Overfield. Scorching blast for 20 damage. It's better than feed the core. Uh, took some damage, it's fine. Um, Gatling. Uh, overfield takes me to 16, which is actually uh, maxes out, that's actually maxes out my shields, so max out, yeah, so that, 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 that. On fire for eight turns, taking a little bit of damage every turn. It just takes one damage every seven turns, it actually is two damage, I think. Offensive effect. Um Player ship is on fire. No, no, am I? No, I'm not. There's still on fire. Um, offensive effect is not an attack, so catch maneuver won't work. Wrong enemy intent. No shield ricochet. Plasma blade, plasma burst, plasma burst. Offensive effect. Player enemy disrupts the trunks. Player discards cards. Okay. Uh, Gatling gun. We win anyway, so scorching blast punches you off. <clears throat> I'm enjoying for the win, but for the win, for the warp. And so far, it's been quite easy. I'm gonna go for overfield again. See if we can sell some more regular shielding. Warp station 76. The car DM system. You found your way into Big Market Station. You need to prepare for your journey ahead. Spend your money wisely. You've been given five fuel free of charge. AI core accuracy 20% increased damage of all weapons. Uh, yes. Drone dispenser heals 1 HP per turn. Yeah, maybe. Extreme prejudice deals 7 damage to a target or 15 if it's disabled or on fire. Yes. Drone attack wave deals 3 damage to each target to target for each active drone you have. I haven't got a way to make drones. Um, photon beam uses 5 shields to deal 10 damage to target for free. Plasma Napalm does 2 damage, 10 damage to all enemies. Um, I'll take Shield Ricochet again. Nope, I'm okay. I guess we're gonna move on now. Um, take some fights, because we need the credits. All your credits are belong to me. Volman Rebel Frigate attacking me, so can't maneuver immediately. Overfields to immediately nullify their attack and fire their burst, obviously, because they do most of the damage there. The plus 10% of damage is also fantastic. Um, if they're disabled, they actually take more damage, so attack eight, 10 to 18 damage. So, overfield. Inspiring shots, draws a card, please. 
and counter maneuver will finish him off. It's 18 credits, Plasma Maelstrom deals 10 damage to target and charges 10 shields. Gain 2 energy, lose 6 HP for Core Breach. No, I'll take Plasma Maelstrom, thank you very much. Basically, for 2 energy, you get more damage than a Plasma Burst and charge more shields than an Overshields, so... I'll take that, indeed. Volman Ironclad. Uh, Gatling Gun, obviously. Uh, a complete denying, so overfeel, Plasma Burst, Plasma Burst. Attack 3 to 9, so Gatling Gun, obviously. Um, overfeel, Photon Beam, Shield Ricochet, Plasma Burst, and Shield Ricochet. It's 14 damage rather than 12. Uh, Plasma Maelstrom, Inspiring Shot, Plasma Burst. You have three shields, uh, Plasma Maelstrom, just finishes you off. With seven credits, pick a Rocket Salvo, deals 15 damage to the target, Overload Prime. Deals 6 damage multiplied by the ship's energy. Our energy or their energy? Overload the Prime Core, redirect it to the Plasma Cannons. I'm curious what this does, so I'm going to grab that instead. Um, we can go through the fights, because the fights look a way to get cards, and frankly, just keep on. Volman Thug and a Volman Elite. Um, well, not really a choice, is there? Kills first. You got 30 shields though. Um, Plasma Maelstrom. I'm not going to use that because it's going to remove some shields for us to rather have. Core and feed the core. There you go. Work your way through those shields. Now. That hurts. Fair enough. Uh, attacking. So Plasma Maelstrom on you. Counter maneuver on you to get rid of that attack, maybe? Should ricochet. Counter maneuver. Use the ability to do that. And. Uh, photon beam. Do that. Chop me for 12 damage, of course they did. Um, twisted fire starter. Overfield. Inspiring shot. I should die next turn, hopefully. There you go. Uh, 16 to 24 damage. That's a lot of damage. Let's max out our shields then. We go for... Oh, Extreme Prejudice will actually hurt you quite a bit. So Overfield, Shield Ricochet, Extreme Prejudice, either four. There we go. Uh, Overfield. Scorching Blast. Put on the... Oh, There we go. Attack drone, launch a 2-1 drone. It does 10 damage, discard a random card, or launch a drone. Let's find out what drones do then, shall we? As it's a station over here, let's go to the station. Launch a 4-2 drone. Basic maneuvers, damage taken extra is reduced by 50%. Scrap card for 20, yes, let's scrap a card, because I definitely want to scrap some of these cards. Uh, considering I've got two overfields, scrapping a point defense sounds good. Scrapping plasma burst is probably useful as well. I've got more than one plasma yeah, I've got it, so scrap the plasma burst. And I think also we'll, we'll keep moving. No, I want to keep thinning my deck rather than adding to it. So catching maneuver does nothing, so this is double plasma burst and turn. Defense up. You're defensing up again, are you? Okay. Uh, shield Ricochet, Shield Ricochet, Plasma Burst, Overfield. It's an attack. Attack drone. Attack to defense one. Okay. A Gatling gun. Uh, shield Ricochet, Shield Ricochet, Overfield, because why not? 
Gatling gun. Attack gun again. What is he actually doing? Hang on. Inspiring Shot of Warcar. Shield Ricochet. Plasma Ghost. You attack me? We're doing damage, okay, so they're doing. Two damage at pop, maybe? Prime defense repairs <clears> three <throat> HP. Repairs HP. Done. A heal on a card basis. That's ridiculously strong. Um, shield ricochet over field plasma burst. Offensive effect. Not sure what that is. Not it's not an attack though. So, um, scorching blast. Photon beam. Shield ricochet. Overfield, I guess. Assembly done, launching drone. A rabid drone. 24 damage. Um, well, that'll finish you off pretty much. That and that'll finish you off. There you go. Offensive effect doesn't help me much. So we're inspiring shot and no extra energy. Cool. Uh, fires I and B, minus one max shields. So it is, okay. Attack drone time. Uh, scorching Blast on you. Actually, so, six multiplied by ship's energy. Does it actually use all my energy to do that? It doesn't. Wow. That card is... The card balancing is very off here. Because a similar a card in Slay the Spire would say, okay, does your ship, your energy times this number, but it would consume all the energy to do so, but it costs all your energy. But does that number times six? Or them costing one energy, but doing your total, your available energy times. That's crazy. Last resort. Deals 30 damage to target, charges 10 shields, discards your hand. Or receive no damage next turn, lose one shield capacity. I'm gonna do it for last resort, because that's a very useful use of three energy. Especially since it's not really last resort, because I've got four energy to start with. Over there, what's over there? Uh, open a crate, let's open a crate. One time defense. Okay, that's just an exhaust card. It increases seal capacity by 10 and gains 10 shields. Ridiculous. It increases my max shields to 25 and gives me 10 shields. It's very, very good. Uh, did a distress beacon? Hailing colony. It seems you've encountered a hailing colony at the planet's surface. You have a data package to be delivered to the nearest warp gate and offering a reward in advance. Um, take some money, take some fuel, or rare equipment. Refusing equipment. Extra plating, plus 10 max HP. Cool. Um, keep swerving around the walls. Rogue AI Factory. Scorching Blast over field. Shield Ricochet. That's an effect. So if you shield it up, that doesn't make a difference. I'm gonna. Prime Defense. That's gonna give me some shielding and some healing. Inspiring Shot. Extreme Prejudice for 15 damage. 18 because of the bonuses. And overfield for no apparent reason. Somebody join us online. Uh, ex we can't extreme prejudice anymore. We can. It's still strictly better than anything else we've got. Let's finish you off then, shall we? Yeah. It just feels really easy. Last resort, we went. I'm enjoying it, but it's so easy. Heavy drone, opportunity, draw random card with energy energy cost from your deck. Oh, that's fantastic. I've only got one three energy cost from my deck that's guaranteed to draw last resort. Uh, opportunity, don't need that. Oh, they want to give me 80 for that card. No, that's, that card's actually quite useful. It's essentially a draw last resort card. Um, one time defense, point defense, plasma burst, you. Okay, uh, attack drone, twisted fire starter, um, plasma maelstrom to get some shields up as well, so. Okay. Um, shield ricochet, plasma burst. 
firing shots. Gatling gun. Point defense. Point defense. Pokemon beam. Takes the damage off this, obviously. But I'll take it. Um. Not enough shields. Okay, I need the shields to do that. In that case, overfield. Photon beam on you to finish you off. Opportunity, last resort. Uh, attacking me, so counter maneuver, last resort. Uh, last resort. Last resort is a really good way to spend a turn, especially if I get my other energy just to shield up before that. Another opportunity? I don't need any of these. I don't need any of these. An exit. I appreciate the heal, but we'll just go for the exit now. Pirate Death Cruiser. Such a puny ship. This will be quick. Overfield, shield ricochet, in the core. Okay. Ow. Okay, so... Um, point defense, obviously. Twisted fire starter, plasma burst, extreme prejudice. I'm gonna keep my shields going up. Boom. I'm gonna mitigate as much damage as possible here. Um, point defense, prime defense, scorching burst. That damage coming down there. Ow. Uh, defensing, so counter maneuver does nothing. Plasma maelstrom. Photon beam, then double point defense to max out my shields. Uh, Overload prime is my first shot, because that does 24 damage. Plus the 20%, that's insane. Um, I got 3 energy left, which is an opportunity for last resort, which would give me 30 damage, which is 36 damage, plus an extra 10 shields, which I don't need. One time charge, uh, shield ricochet, extreme prejudice, and Gatling gun, Gatling gun. You're defending now, so it doesn't much do much to just me. Um, extreme prejudice, last resort. It seems to be this game is so easy. Removes all shields from enemies and disables them. I'll we'll grab that, although it's the second. It's now reason to get a second opportunity. Carthium system, this nation, the Zinto system. Okay, that's sector three of five. Market. Uh, laser cannon, ignite two, deals five damage to target. Plus 10%, plus 10 max shields, minus 5 max HP. Plus 1 HP per turn. The drone dispenser. I think I've full up on, ex on uh, an equipment right now, so there's a cannon. A heavy drone. I'm oh, good. How's my how's my gear looking at the moment? Certified shielding. Can't put anything over there? No, okay, fine. No, I'll take that extra max. I'll take the extra max shielding. There you go. Um, free zone vulture. That's my maelstrom. Inspiring shot. Shield ricochet. Um, Gatling gun. Overload prime. Which is a broken ability. The fact that only takes one energy. That is such a broken ability. Inspiring shot. One time defense. Gatling gun. Prime defense. Scorching blast. Uh, Orbity shield drone. Because one shield capacity is the element of combat. Crypto hack. Gain five friends for each enemy. Money isn't really a problem for the shield drones. Um, 
My deck is growing now. Uh, Extreme Prejudice, Laser Cannon, Hexalite Apostate, Hexalite Rebel. A lot of damage coming my way right now. I can't really stop that, unfortunately, so we're gonna do the damage we can do. Uh, attacking, so counter maneuver. Point defense. Puzzle burst. Uh, point defense again, because I can't kill you this turn, so I might as well mitigate damage as much as possible. Uh, attacking again, so that kills you off. Gatling gun on you. Uh, Ignite two. Scorching blast. There you go. Uh, taking one. I'm on, I'm on fire. Taking one damage per turn for three for one turn. So okay. prime defense on me. No, no. Wait, uh, overload prime on you. There you go. Counter maneuver as well. Heal me. And point defense just to guarantee that I actually don't take damage this turn. There you go. Um. Scorching Blast to finish off the job. Stolen Cloak by Singularity Gun. Deal sweet damage to target, then disables them. Deactivate. Yes, please. Uh, go to the station there. You can scrap something here, please. I can't, I can't scrap anything. Special Circumstances. Destroys the target. If it's a boss, deals 40 damage instead. Yes? Like, absolutely yes. How's that even a question? Okay, so Gatling gun on you. Opportunity. Uh, ring down, everyone. That's very useful for me. Disabled. Good. Attacking you now because you're the quickest one to die. I think. So, okay. There you go. Well disabled for a turn. Brilliant. Uh, destroys the target. If it's the boss, puts damage instead. Done. Receives 1,199 damage. Uh, Gatling gun on you. Uh, Gatling gun again. Uh, opportunity. Laser cannon, last resort. Uh, Overload prime. I need to heal up though. I need to heal up. I need to be far more defensively oriented, I think. Not sure I picked that, to be honest. That probably wasn't necessary, that counter maneuver there. Hexless Objector. Orbital Shield Drone, Point Defense, Scorching Blast. I was actually flying around, I was expecting the, the drone to appear. Um, right, so Shield Ricochet, Overfield, Laser Cannon, Puzzle Burst. Okay. Uh, Defending, so eh. One time defense, it's more useful to grab that one now. Orbiting shield drone. You're defending, so counter maneuver does nothing. And opportunity, not required. There's no point in drawing opportunity now. Um, shield ricochet. Laser cannon. That was a mistake on my part. Yeah, I should have fired that first and then point defense. Defending, so uh, extreme prejudice. Point on me. Good before. Um, oh, look, fine. Uh, Cats maneuver. There we go. And if optimize shielding. That's useful, because now I've got the point where actually I've got several... My shield capacity can be quite big now, so being able to fully charge it would not be a bad thing. They're going to give me 200 for one-time defense. No. I like one-time defense, thank you very much. We have seven fuel, so one, two, three, four, five, six. Wow, okay, that just cuts me short, doesn't it? Well, okay, I'll take that as red and just go to the warp gate. Why not? I'll, I'll take a hint. I'll take a hint. 
free zone kingpin and two hexless creepers and stuff like that. So, um, feed the, uh, defense, defense, defense. Okay, so we'll feed the core on this thing. Seeing that again does 50, 50 damage to target and immediately disables it. And disables them. And disables them. Okay, so, um, we can ring down here, can't we? Alternatively, I go Optimate Shielding. Inspiring Shot. Opportunity. I'm gonna ring down this turn. I'll ring down this turn. We get some stuff next turn to help out with this. Well, okay, we get that again. That's, that's actually works really well for us. One time defense. Um, a lot of damage coming out of there. But I can kill off that entirely immediately if I want to with Singularity Gun, or I can put a lot of damage onto this guy. that immediately just to help out a little bit more a defense and attacking there so gatling gun on you um shield ricochet on you ring down Aim for the disable um wow okay optimate shielding attack drone they can't get through my shields they can do maximum of 32 damage um, counter maneuver on you. Ring down. I'm getting ring downs very consistently. Um, ricochet on you. Last resort on you. Okay, now you're doing 30 to 60 damage. That's a lot of damage, Sunshine. Uh, that is, okay, it's an incredible amount of damage. I can straight up die here. Even if I full shield, even if I full shield, I can just die here. So Gatling Gun. Opportunity, ring down. Um, overfield, just start charging now. <laughs> Offensive effect. Um, I'm gonna go for laser cannon. Um, Plasma Maelstrom, Extreme Prejudice. Uh, not sure what happened to us there, but it's fine. Special success is just does damage, defense for us. Uh, Gatling Gun, Overload Prime, uh, Attack Drone, Scorching Blast. I've got three attack drones up and running now. Uh, okay, so Gatling Gun, Shield Ricochet, Attack Drone again, Extreme Prejudice, Overfield. Shoot me. The little drone's just ticking away at that, and special circumstances just finish you off. And they like the KD carrier. Okay. AI Supremacy launches four. Five four four drones charge ten shields capacity until end of combat, and that's n and that's not a and that's not a disable card. That's insane. I was gonna stop after the end of this fight, but I want to be able to use that ability that card just once, just to check if it's not actually consumed. Because if that card's not consumed, then that card is also broken. Uh, Master Converger, each time you discard a card, gain plus one energy. Powering down, deactivate a card in your deck, draw a card. That is actually quite helpful. That is very helpful, because it starts clearing useless deck cards from your deck. You know what? I'm going to grab that. We'll move on. Um... I want to see what that AI Mastery card actually does. 
Special circumstances. Oh, wow, really? Okay, goodbye. Also, stupidly good card. <laughs> be a crap card if it didn't have four energy, but I got because I got four energy. Eh. Um. Let me, yeah, let me some more fights. Come on, I want to try out this AI yeah, mastery card. Uh, twisted fire starter. Everyone burns. Shield ricochet. And then yeah, they've got a lot of shielding. Ring down will be really good here. There you go, so, uh, Gatling Gun, new. Uh, special circumstances to just kill you off outright would probably be a good idea as well, to be honest. But I'm curious about this thing. Like, oh, that's what, that's a total of 24 damage. <sighs> and I'll give you an uh, inspiring shot on you. Gatling gun. I might die here because I'm being quite silly with all my stuff. But, you know. Gatling gun again. Good. Let's go quite defensive now. Uh, point defense as well. Extreme prejudice. That hurts. Uh, optimize shielding. Fully charges my shields. That's going to help me out quite a bit. And more heavy drones. Scorching blasts can do do double damage up there. But I kind of want to focus on you right now because you're the one who's really hurting me. You'll die at the beginning of next turn, though. Yeah, you're dead. Hurrah. Gatling on you, Gatling on you. Opportunity, last resort on you. Okay. Uh, I haven't seen that card again, so maybe it's not a thing. I can just turn up multiple times. Part of me wants to just stay in combat for as long as possible, just to figure out if that is a possible opportunity. Do I get AI mastery back? It's still in the deck. Still in the deck, so point defense. Shield Ricochet might kill you off though. Because you want one health. Oh, my drones will finish you off. Fine. Opportunity also can draw AI mastery. Lucky shot deals 8 damage to target. Plasma storm deals 20 damage to all ships. 20 damage to your ship. Okay. I'm okay with not grabbing any of that. I need to repair myself though. If you can find a Somewhere I can repair myself. In a trade station, does that can I repair myself here? I don't think I've seen the ability to repair myself, but uh, one time defense, another one. Barrel roll received no damage next turn. But useful. I'll take that though. Um, well, we'll have, to, we'll have to die at some point. I've been quite cavalier. I've been quite cavalier. Attack, attack, defense. Okay, so AI supremacy. Overfield. A lot of damage happening everywhere. Uh, point defense. Point defense. That's going to be a total of what? That's, this is more damage. Let's ignite and. Uh, that does what? 10 damage. This does a total of 13 damage before the bonuses. I need ring down. I want my opportunities now. That's me down. Fair enough. Fair enough. I was being quite cavalier by the end of that. Just wanting to get that thing done. But what's this last ship that I've unlocked? The K the KD carrier shields four sixty hull sixty so less hull more shields four equipment slots. Provides an on attack drone on board, assembler and launcher, providing a wide range of offensive interactions versus a large drone capacity while lacking mounted firepower and lighter hull. What do you actually have? Let's get through this, thank you. Yep, yep, the beginning is all fine. Now that I've seen what all ships can do, maybe I'll do one more playthrough after this and second video and, and try to be a little bit more serious about it and maybe go a little bit more explorey, I don't know. Come on. 
can skip through this. Uh, once we have we have we have shields up, which still turns into point defense. Instead of ah uh, uh, instead of having guns, we just create a ton of drones, and then we would just capitalize on drone attack wave. Interesting. Extra plating, siphoning drone. You see a one fuel from a card. Target draw a card. Damage multiplied is okay. So next time, I'll do the um. I'll play. I'll probably play one as the um, as the KD carrier. But anyway, folks, let me know if you want there to be next time. Otherwise, I'll catch you all with the next video. See you then, folks. Uh, bye bye.